Hi, welcome to the SQL Server video tutorial. In this video, I'm going to talk about introduction to using the Azure Data Studio. Now, the Azure Data Studio is a cross-platform database tool for data professionals using the on-premises and cloud data platforms on the Windows, Mac operating system, and Linux. We can actually use the Azure Data Studio to one query, two design and manage our databases and data warehouses either on our local computer or in the cloud. So let's see how we can actually use this as a data studio. Now, I'm currently in my Microsoft SQL Server Management Studio and I have this database and I have this transaction data table. Now let's fetch all the records from this management studio using a select all statement. So I'm gonna say select all from then i'm going to provide the name of the table which is transaction underscore data and then i can actually click on this execute or deploy f5 to run the query and then we have all these records you can actually you know scroll down and see all the records we have more than ten thousand records now let's see the azure data studio now you can actually you know just from your window key just type in the azure okay and you can actually launch from here or you can even come to the tools group and click on Azure Data Studio and it will be launched as an independent platform. So the first thing we need to do here is to connect to our SQL, you know, details. So I'm going to click on, you know, connect and then we can actually connect using the server name. Now my server name is simple Abiola, then backward slash Abiola SQL. And of course I use Windows authentication. So I need to actually connect to the particular database, which is data. So I'm gonna click on here and I select data database. And finally, I click on connect. So you can actually see that I've been connected to the database, which is coming from my management studio, which is this data. So all I need to do is to write a simple, you know, select or query again and fetch all my records. So I'm gonna say select. Now this is actually from the Azure Data Studio. You can actually see, so I'm gonna say select all from, then I'm gonna provide the name of the table, which is transaction underscore data, then press the tab key. And of course you can even use F5 to run the query and it's gonna work. So we have the data looking cool. Now, if we return to the management studio, let's say we wanna use the where clause in here. I'm gonna say, you know, where units is greater than or equals to, let's say a hundred. So we are actually using two math operators. So when we execute, we have this data narrowed down using the where clause and we have 1760 rows. So if we have to return to the Azure Data Studio and do the same thing, you can actually see that we're gonna get the same results. So let's use the where clause, where units is greater than or equals to a hundred. And then we can actually, you know, click on this row or F5, and then we have the same 1,760 rows of records. So this is essentially how we can actually use the Azure Data Studio, which is available in Microsoft SQL Server 2019. In the subsequent videos, I'm going to be showing you how to write some really complex and sub queries in this Azure Data Studio. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please remember to hit the subscribe button and also the bell icon to get notification. Thank you and bye for now. Cheers.